Hi there. Um, I'm going to challenge myself a bit today. Um, I'm going to install a new dropper post over the weekend. Um, and it's an internal rooted dropper post, but I'm going to stick it in a old hardtail guitar arc frame that I've got that I've converted to a um, converted to a single speed. Oh, let's see. It's a little single speed masochistic thing. Anyway, nice little old frame, um, but it desperately does need a dropper because it's bucked me off a few times um, when I'm taking over to Twisted Oaks. Anyway, so um, I'm going to internally root it from here, down the tube and up here, but I'm going to use the vacuum cleaner and a piece of thread method using Mr. Henry. Um, and I've plugged up the uh, down tube ports where the rear mech and the front mech would normally have come out. And with a bit of masking tape, I've also plugged up that port there. And also the seat tube, I have um, put some masking tape around the slats, the compression slats to this there. So what I'm going to do is put the hoover, which I've put this end on, so it makes a good seal over the tube, uh, just a bit of plumbing. Um, because the slat on the um, on the end of the Henry won't seal very well. So I'll push that on the end, hold this on the end, and then try and suck the cable, or sorry, not the cable, try and suck the piece of cotton through here, down the tube, and up here and out. And then, after I've done that, I then need to attach a little bit of fishing line to the end and um, pull the fishing line through before I put a cable through, because the piece of cotton thread that I'm going to pull through is not going to be very strong. It's not going to be strong enough to uh, pull a cable through. So, let's give it a go. Henry, piece of cotton. Henry. Right, here we go. Right, got it. It might be easier if I put the hoover at the bottom and the thread at the top, but... There you go, it's worked. So, be careful not to snap it. So, piece coming out the top, piece coming out the bottom. I'm just going to attach a piece of um, fishing line to the end of this um, and then pull it through and then we'll go for the cable. So I'm just going to stop here a tick. Back again. So, you probably can't see that. We've got a piece of... Where is that? 15 pound fishing line. I don't think the poundage matters. It's just stronger than a bit of cotton really. Um, to the bottom and then I'll try and pull that out of the top. So, 
to just now need to go and get myself some gear cable dropper cable, which I haven't got. So, thank you GMBN for that hack. Um, they turned the bike the other way around, but actually I don't think you need to. Um, yeah, just use a piece of thin cotton. So, uh, I'll get that sorted a bit later on. Thank you very much. Cheers.